Welcome to the support videos for workload automation video series. This video will demonstrate why is history section not visible, disabled, or grayed out in the Control M Enterprise Manager reporting tool. Log into the Control M workload automation client and open the Control M reporting tool from the tools domain. We can see the history section is grayed out. The Control M forecast is required to be installed to enable the reports in the history section. In the Control M configuration manager, we can see that the Control M forecast is not installed on this Control M Enterprise Manager server currently. Let's install the Control M forecast. The Control M forecast installation package has been downloaded and extracted on this machine. Open the installation folder and double click the setup application file. In the installation window, tick the I accept the terms of this license agreement box, and click next. Then click next again to start the installation. Now the Control M forecast installation has completed successfully. Click done to close the installation window. Go back to the Control M configuration manager. Click refresh. We can see the Control M forecast component appears in Control M configuration manager now. And its state is up. Let's open a new session of the Control M reporting tool. Now the history section is visible. You can start creating the reports in the history section. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. The Workload Automation Support Team looks forward to helping you, if any assistance is needed.